All right, hey, what's up guys? We're back out here today for the very first park vlog of the season. I was actually just out walking. I wasn't even planning on filming a vlog or video or even training, but weather's been really, really good now and it looks like it's gonna stay like this. So I decided like, I, while I was out walking, I decided like, hey, you know what? Why don't I do some basics, some light work and just make a video out of it because yeah, this is honestly pretty freaking awesome. And I also just wanted to come on and say uh, that yes, the last video was obviously a joke. And I just want to say thank you guys for all the support on that video. Even though I was joking, I was really surprised at how many people were like, leaving nice supportive uh, comments and messages and stuff like that. And I really just didn't realize like I had a strong community like that. So seriously, thank you guys. But yeah, today uh, I'm going over to the monkey bars. If you guys have been watching the channel since 2021, you guys know this setup. This is where I usually had the uh, rings hanging from the monkey bars and I would always do my ring skills there. But then I just stayed inside basically all last year because it was super convenient. But now I'm kind of excited to get back outside and do at least some outdoor training because staying that downstairs is just kind of boring not gonna lie so I also think it's boring for you guys too I think you guys like seeing a change of uh, scenery so I'm gonna go over there I'm gonna start if now it did rain so there might be a puddle under the bar so I might have to abort mission there if it's too muddy uh, but then after that I might plan on stopping over by you can't even see them wait oh no I'm just not Oh, I can't even zoom. I can't even zoom when I'm filming, but uh, then there's a parallel bar set up. Uh, that's actually where I filmed my Hefesto tutorial, if you guys have seen that video. Now, and then I'll go there and do maybe like some light planche and front lever stuff. The planche and the front lever stuff on those bars, well, mainly the front lever is going to be really fun and kind of weird <laughs> because that is a really thick bar and the bar that I normally do front lever on just my... Uh, equalizer bars are fairly thin so i could probably do honestly like not even exaggeration i'm not going to try today but maybe i'll try some other time on like an actual workout day uh i could probably do 20 to touch on that bar just because it's so thick and easy so it's basically like half reps but anyway guys yeah we're gonna head over to the first spot and just see uh, what it's looking like. So uh, I'll catch up with you guys. Okay guys, so we're here. As you can see, it's not terrible. It is a little muddy, but I'm just gonna be doing doing my stuff like right here. As you guys can see, the bare hand fit stickers that I placed on these in 2021 are still there. It looks like somebody tried to peel. <laughs> it looks like someone tried to peel them off, but they couldn't. Yeah, I have a bunch more of these bare hand fit stickers. So if I do end up doing ring stuff here, I'll bring a bare hand fit sticker, put it back on here. And then I also have a bunch of Calisthenics Pro stickers. Uh, you can use Barcog A10 for anything on Calisthenics Pro Shop, by the way, for a discount. And yeah, I can bring Calisthenics Pro stickers and I'll slap those on there too. Uh, but then, yeah, so we have this spot, but then there's another park setup that I'm going to be going to probably more often than this. So basically what I'm going to be doing is I'm doing the, kind of the OG classic set, which is muscle up straight bar dip and then a pull up and so i'm gonna do one one muscle up one dip one pull up step off the bar for like maybe one second or something just to regroup and then i'm gonna do two muscle ups two dips two pull ups uh and then you guys kind of know the rest from there so it's gonna be increasing and i might go back down we'll just have to see and uh actually I, I i brought my jump rope too so i'm probably gonna jump rope in between for maybe like 30 seconds or something just as some active rest uh but yeah guys i will uh catch up with you guys after the set let's try to make it to i don't know i haven't done something like this in a while so i'll probably go to i'm gonna try to go five and back down so gonna be awesome let's get it I can't help but feel good, I can't help but feel fine Everything is in its place and everything is mine I can't help but feel good, I can't help but feel fine Everything is in its place and all of it is mine Myself. I'm me and nobody else. I'm reinventing myself. I'm me and nobody else. Ooh, I can't help but smile.
can't help but feel good. I can't help but feel fine. Everything is in its place and everything is mine. I can't help but feel good. I can't help but feel fine. Everything is Okay guys. I'm checking with you guys after the first round of five. That took like five minutes in total. And honestly, as you guys can tell by my breath, that was pretty tough. So I was doing the jump rope in between each one. That might have made it a little bit hard, harder to be quite honest. But I was doing the jump rope on the path because you guys saw like it was just too weird on the grass. I could not do it in the grass. Um, but yeah, man, that, that was pretty tough. That was the, I can't even remember the last time I did muscle ups. Now, of course, I don't count like butterfly, pineda, like all those stupid ring memes uh, that I've obviously done. But uh, yeah, I, I've not done like a regular muscle up in a long time. So really cool. <laughs> Pretty tough set, not gonna lie. Um, I will go back down. Honestly, though, I'm not sure about the jump rope and sorry about the camera angle, guys. I, uh, I, I'm trying to film it so I can film while listening to music. <clears throat> And the only way to do that is to do a quick photo thing. So the angle and the camera and all that is weird. I'm gonna try my best to fix the zoom uh, in post-production, but I don't know, it is what it is. I'm sorry, guys. So anyway, I will do that next round here. It's just, I'm really cheating by talking with the big rest in between. But anyway, we're gonna go with the next round here so it's just gonna be four three two one i hope i can even do it i'm not gonna lie this is freaking hard guys uh yeah here we go let's get it Okay guys, that's the rest of the set. You guys saw um, some of those uh, planches. That's called the Barladin, not Balladin, Barladin when you do it on bar. <laughs> uh, anyway, yeah, that was pretty cool. Um, really tough set, not gonna lie. I do think, I will say the only hard part for me was the muscle ups. I think maybe it's just that it's been so long since I've done them, but yeah, I was really dying there towards the end. Like you guys could definitely tell that my form was just getting consistently worse than those muscle ups to be honest um the pull-ups were pretty easy i would say just it looked the pull-ups probably looked a lot harder than they were because i was trying to come down and make it so i wasn't swinging and making them easier so that's why i was probably doing them a little slower and stuff like that just to make sure i wasn't doing momentum so anyway i'm still gonna head over to the dip bars and do a little bit of stuff but i'm gonna do handstand push-ups first which i was actually gonna add to the circuit but i feel like that would have been a little ridiculous now 
going to do handstand push-ups on just this path here, which is a little weird because it's uneven, but it is what it is. And also, I'm just saying this because people keep asking, what headphones do I use? These are the Beats Fit Pro. And no, I do not recommend you get them. These headphones are actually so terrible. And they're also really freaking expensive, so save your money. Uh, the problem with them is, is sometimes they don't connect properly to my phone. Like I have to constantly open the case just to get them to pair and they fall out constantly it's honestly just really really annoying how much they fall out so really disappointed with this product to be honest but just wanted to talk about it not to hate on beats or whatever <laughs> obviously they don't they don't even care what i say but just because people kept asking me and i'm just saying like these are the headphones i have don't buy them uh yeah i would get 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 another pair not sure what i'd recommend though yes let me do uh some of these hspus and then i'll uh, move on over to the other bars All right, guys, so moving on. That was the set of uh, Hanson push just three sets and then with the jump rope between, in between, sorry. Um, <laughs> no time limit on the jump rope, really. It was kind of tough because I had the fatigue from earlier, but I wasn't, I was just doing it until I just messed up and couldn't do it, so. And then I just did handstand push-ups. I actually wasn't even counting my sets. I think I did three by eight, but I might have miscounted, maybe done a set of seven or something, but I don't remember. Anyway. I think I'm going to title this video something like OG Park Vlog or something because I don't know, just like the vibe of the park doing basics and stuff. It just reminds me of like 2016 or whatever when I would watch like videos on YouTube of like Fortress or whatever. And then I'd come out here and train and just do like progressions for certain skills and stuff. It just, man, it just really brings back some good memories and is a great vibe with the park atmosphere. I freaking love it. So yeah, really cool. Um, like I said, I'm walking over the dip bars just to see what I can do. Uh, I do want to show you guys how hilarious the uh, the front lever setup is here because <laughs> you guys are going to see, like, it, it's really thick. And I'm going to do straight arm touch on that. And uh, it's just going to be such a meme. So, okay, here we go. is they're just a little too wide to do stuff like that uh which is too bad and for those people watching the video that are maybe finding my channel and are wondering like why is planche easier than muscle ups for this guy well i mean yes i think planche is easier than muscle ups for me at least because one of those skills i do every single day versus the other one If I don't, if I'm not liking it today, then I'm probably not going to come to this spot really. Or I might just bring out my own personal parallettes or something like that. But yeah, I'm excited to show you guys the other spot, which you guys have seen before, but not for a while. So uh, it, it'll be pretty interesting. But yeah, like I said, probably just push up attempt. And yeah, we'll just we'll just go from there. We'll, we'll kind of vibe. So uh, yeah, stay tuned. everybody so unfortunately i'm going to have to abruptly end this video as you guys can tell in it's pretty windy right now uh, as you can tell by that last uh push-up clip with terrible form by the way um but it is what it is uh, it's actually about to start raining and there is something there is a package at my house that i need to bring in so i need to get back before it's uh before that starts coming down on that so uh, anyway yeah 
The push-up, like I said, terrible form, but it was windy and I did all the sets before that with the muscle-ups. Uh, wasn't terrible though, and I could definitely train on those bars, I think, which is good, because I'll be doing that a couple times this year, probably. And um, yeah, unfortunately, because I had to end it, I didn't get a chance to try out my front lever stuff, but it is what it is, not really too worried about. It. Today's not really a very serious training session anyway, uh, because I'm kind of back on the grind where it's like every other day I do like intensity stuff, like a lot of my high level main skills. And then on days like this, I just kind of do basic stuff like that, like the muscle ups and whatever. Now I'm not saying the basic stuff is easy, but it's just something I can do. Uh, I, I can just do it whenever. So it's really good. And honestly today, this workout felt really good. Let me know what you guys thought of this video and I can do more of it. Uh, like I said, there is, I know at least one other spot that I'm gonna take you guys to. So you guys can check that out. Um, and then there's some other parks that are pretty far from here, but if you guys are really liking the park vibe, I can uh, dri drive out to those too. So uh, yeah, thanks for watching guys. Uh, like if you did, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Deuces.